हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज वाई वी आर वेलकम टू वाई वी आर मैथ्स ट्यूटोरियल लाइक द प्रीवियस वन वी आर बैक अगेन विथ अनदर वीडियो फोकसिंग ऑन एन इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक सो फार वी हैव बीन इंटीग्रेटिंग सिंपल फंक्शंस नाउ वी शेल लर्न सम टेक्निक्स ऑफ इंटीग्रेशन व्हिच विल एनेबल अस टू इंटीग्रेट सम वॉट मोर कॉम्प्लिकेटेड फंक्शंस व्हिच वी एनकाउंटर इन मैथमेटिक्स so in this video i am going to discuss how to evaluate the integrals if it is in the form of integral ax plus b into over root cx plus d dx and integral ax plus b by root of cx plus d dx before going to evaluate these type of integrals you should know basic definitions and basic properties and basic formulas of indefinite integrals If you did not watch my earlier classes get the links from the description cards to understand the concept easily watch this video till the end let's start the discussion how to evaluate the given integral if it is in the form of integral ax plus b into over root cx plus d dx and integral ax plus b by over root cx plus d dx before moving forward please subscribe our channel and click the bell icon to get the notifications of our latest updates in order to evaluate this type of integrals we should follow some algorithm so to evaluate this type of integrals i will give you one algorithm if we follow that algorithm we can easily solve this type of problems so in that algorithm i will explain first step what is the step one from the given integrand write ax plus b in terms of cx plus d so how we can write ax plus b in terms of cx plus d see here i will give you one relation ax plus b is equal to lambda into cx plus d plus mu here lambda and mu are real numbers so we need to find this lambda value and mu value so this is the first step ax plus b should write in terms of cx plus d then how to find the lambda value and mu value here see here next one step 2 in step 2 we are going to find the unknown values lambda and mu so to find the value of lambda and mu equating the coefficients of like powers of x from the equation which we discussed in the first step on both sides so if you equate the corresponding coefficients on both sides then we will get the lambda value and mu value then after getting the lambda value and mu value we can express ax plus b in terms of lambda into cx plus d plus mu now after completing the second step that means after finding the lambda value and mu value we can go for step 3 so in step 3 what we are going to do in the given integrand we have ax plus b in ax plus b place we have to replace lambda into cx plus d plus a mu term so if you replace ax plus b with lambda into cx plus d plus mu then what you will get see here integral ax plus b into over root cx plus d into dx is equal to integral just i am substituting here ax plus b term lambda into cx plus d plus mu into over root cx plus d dx now if you observe the right side part of integrand we have product of two terms if you multiply both the terms then what you will get see in the next step integral lambda into cx plus d into over root cx plus d plus mu into over root cx plus d dx now here root of cx plus d is nothing but cx plus d whole power 1 by 2 so in the next step i am going to write that one so integral lambda into cx plus d into cx plus d whole power 1 by 2 plus mu into cx plus d whole power 1 by 2 dx so cx plus d into cx plus d whole power 1 by 2 is nothing but cx plus d whole power 3 by 2 because if bases are equal power should be added at the same time i am going to apply individual integrals by using the basic properties of indefinite integrals then in the next step what you will get see here lambda into integral cx plus d whole power 3 by 2 dx plus 
म्यू इंटू इंटीग्रल सी एक्स प्लस डी होल पवर वन बै टू डी एक्स सो आलि वी हव डिस्कड सम बेसि फार्मुला प्रीवियस् क्लास सो वि नो वाट इज द इंटिग्रेशन आफ् ए एक्स प्लस बी होल पवर एंड डी एक्स सो बेस्ड ऑन दट फार्मुलाई विल रईट नेक्स्ट टेम सो सी हियर लैमडा इंटू सी एक्स प्लस डी होल पवर फै बै टू बै फै बै टू इंटू सी प्लस म्यू इंटू सी एक्स प्लस डी होल पवर थ्री बै टू बै थ्री बै टू इंटू सी प्लस कैपिटल सी हियर दिस कैपिटल सी इज द इंटीग्रल कॉन्स्टेंट सो जस्ट ई अप्लाइड हियर इंटीग्रल ए एक्स प्लस बी होल पवर एंड डी एक्स फार्मुला सो बेस्ड ऑन दट फार्मुला ओनली ई रोड दिस स्टेप सो इफ यू सिंप्लीफ दिस वन दैन वाट यू विल गेट सी इन द नेक्स्ट स्टेप टू लैमडा बै फाइव सी इंटू सी एक्स प्लस डी होल पवर फै बै टू प्लस टू म्यू बै थ्री सी इंटू सी एक्स प्लस डी होल पवर थ्री बै टू प्लस सी सो इफ द गिवेन इंटीग्रेंट इज इन द फॉर्म आफ इंटीग्रल ए एक्स प्लस बी इंटू ओवर रूट सी एक्स प्लस डी डी एक्स दिस इज द प्रोसेस इन स्टेप थ्री वाट वी डिस्कस दिस इज द प्रोसेस टू फाइंड द इंटीग्रेशन आफ द फस्ट इंटीग्रेंट so by using same step 1 step 2 we will solve the second part of integration also so the second part means integral ax plus b by over root cx plus d dx so i will explain this part in the next slide here we will discuss second integral part so based on the step 1 step 2 concept the numerator part of given integrand can be written as lambda into cx plus d plus mu So, if you write the step here, then what you will get? See here, integral a x plus b by over root c x plus d into d x is equal to integral lambda into c x plus d plus mu by over root c x plus d d x. Now, divide each term of numerator with the denominator term. Then what you will get? See here in the next step, integral. Lambda into c x plus d by over root c x plus d plus mu by over root c x plus d d x. By using basic properties of indefinite integrals, I am going to apply individual integrals. Then what you will get? See here in the next step. Lambda into integral c x plus d by over root c x plus d d x plus mu into integral one by over root c x plus d d x. We know that x by root x can be written as root x. So based on that basic knowledge, the next step can be written as lambda into integral over root c x plus d d x plus mu into integral one by over root c x plus d d x. We know the standard formulas: integral x power n d x and integral one by root x d x. So by applying these two formulas, we will get next step. See here. Lambda into c x plus d whole power three by two by c into three by two plus mu into two into over root of c x plus d by c plus c. So if we simplify this one, then what you will get? See here in the next step, two lambda by three c into c x plus d whole power three by two plus two mu by c into c x plus d whole power one by two plus c. Here, capital C is the integral constant. Just I applied the standard formulas here to get this answer. So this is the actual process or proper algorithm to evaluate the integrals if it is in this form. So based on this algorithm, let us discuss some problems. In this algorithm, we have discussed two types of integrals. Now let us discuss one problem based on first model. See here, question number one. Evaluate integral seven x minus two into over root three x plus two dx. So the given problem is clearly in the form of integral a x plus b into over root c x plus d dx format. So we should follow the algorithm what we discussed in the previous slide. So let us discuss solution of this one. First of all, I will consider the given integral as capital I. Then let I is equal to integral seven x minus two into over root three x plus two dx. As we discussed in the given algorithm, 
here ax plus b can be written as in terms of cx plus d. That means ax plus b is equal to lambda into cx plus d plus mu. So based on that concept, here let 7x minus 2 is equal to lambda into 3x plus 2 plus mu. So if you multiply right side part of terms, then what we will get? See here, 7x minus 2 is equal to 3 lambda x plus 2 lambda plus mu. Now, on equating the coefficients of like powers of x on both sides, then what you will get? See here, if you equate the corresponding coefficient of x on both sides, then 3 lambda is equal to 7. And if you compare the constant on both sides, then what you will get? 2 lambda plus mu is equal to minus 2. See here in the next step, 3 lambda is equal to 7 and 2 lambda plus mu is equal to minus 2. Then 3 lambda is equal to 7 means lambda is equal to 7 by 3. And this lambda value, if you substitute in the second part, then what you will get? See here, lambda is equal to 7 by 3 and mu is equal to minus 2 minus 2 times of 7 by 3. So just I substituted lambda value in this equation. If you simplify this one, then what you will get? Lambda is equal to 7 by 3 and mu is equal to minus 20 by 3. As we discussed in algorithm, we completed step 1 and step 2. So now we will start step 3. What is step 3? This is 7x minus 2 value we can substitute in the given integral. Then i is equal to integral 7 by 3 into 3x plus 2 minus 20 by 3 into over root 3x plus 2 dx. Now we can multiply these two terms. Then what you will get? See here in the next step. Integral 7 by 3 into 3x plus 2 into over root 3x plus 2 minus 20 by 3 into over root 3x plus 2 dx. Based on basic properties of indefinite integrals, I am going to apply individual integrals. Then what we will get? See here in the next step. 7 by 3 into integral 3x plus 2 into over root 3x plus 2 dx minus 20 by 3 into integral over root 3x plus 2 dx. If we observe the integrand of first integral 3x plus 2 and 3x plus 2 whole power 1 by 2. So if base is equal, power should be added. Then based on that concept, this can be written as, see here in the next step, 7 by 3 into integral 3x plus 2 whole power 3 by 2 dx minus 20 by 3 into integral 3x plus 2 whole power 1 by 2 dx. We know the standard formulas, integral ax plus b whole power n dx. So based on this standard formula, what is the next step? See here, 7 by 3 into 3x plus 2 whole power 5 by 2 by 5 by 2 into 3 minus 20 by 3 into 3x plus 2 whole power 3 by 2 by 3 by 2 into 3 plus c. If we simplify this one, then what we will get? See in the next step, 14 by 45 into 3x plus 2 whole power 5 by 2 minus 40 by 27 into 3x plus 2 whole power 3 by 2 plus c. Here capital C is the integral constant. So we completed third step also. So this is the final answer for the given integral. I hope you understand. Based on this model, I will give you two questions for self-practice. See here. Question number 2 and question number 3. So pause the video and solve these two problems. If you do not get the idea how to solve these problems, you can watch again this problem what we discussed till now. To get the notifications of our latest update, please subscribe our channel and activate bell icon. Thank you for watching this video. Drop a like and share with your friends. Thank you. Thank you very much.